They call me Squirrel. What's going on, Squirrel Squad? It's good to have you today over here on the other side of Squirrel. This is the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald Gordon Lightfoot. Uh, so I've had multiple people request this. Um, I know that uh, a lot of people have said, hey, man, hey, you should you should check this out. I didn't know what it was. I didn't, you know, like I just keep seeing like the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald. I was thinking, is this like a car racing video? I had no idea, but it, it was, but, you know, it took me, you know, going a little thick. Uh, it took me a little bit of time to realize that uh, it was on the music channel, so it must be music. So I'm thinking this is music. <laughs> this is HD with lyrics. Got to be music, right? Uh, so let's watch the wreck of the Edmund. I have no clue at all what this is. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure it's good, though, because I've had a lot of great people recommend this to me. Some of my regulars, people that are, that, that are, that, that are long-time um, supporters of both my channels, those are the <clears throat> folks that have recommended this to me, so I know we're getting into something good here. So let's uh, take a look at this, and uh, we'll chat about it at the end. If it's your first time here, we're doing some music reactions. We're doing um, oh, the wreck of the admin. It's, yeah, you know, like, subscribe, hit the bell, leave a comment, say hello, watch them, Edmund Fitzgerald, Gerald Fitzedmund. The wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald, Gordon Lightfoot. Here we go. The legend lives on from the Chippewa on down of the big lake they call Gitchagumi. The lake, it is said, never gives up her dead when the skies of November turn gloomy. With a load of iron ore, 26,000 tons more than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty. That good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side, coming back from some mill in Wisconsin. As the big freighters go, it was bigger than most, with a crew and good captain well seasoned. Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland Then later that night when the ship's bell rang Could it be the north wind they'd been feeling? Tattletail sound and the wave broke over the railing. And every man knew as the captain did too, twas the witch of November come stealing. The dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait when the gales of November came slashing. When afternoon came, it was freezing rain. In the face of a hurricane west wind When supper time came The old cook came on deck Saying, fellas, it's too rough to feed you p.m. a main hatchway gave in He said, fellas, it's been good to know ya The captain wired in, he had water coming in And the good ship and crew was in peril And later that night when his lights went out of sight Came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald Does anyone know where the love of God goes When the waves turn the minutes to hours? The searchers all say they 
the midway fish bay if they put 15 more miles behind her. They might have split up or they might have capsized. They may have broke deep and took water. And all that remains is the faces and the names of the wives and the sons and the daughters. Lake Huron Rose Superior sings In the rooms of her ice water mansion Old Michigan steams like a young man's dreams The islands and bays are for sportsmen And farther below Lake Ontario Takes in what Lake Erie can send her The iron boats go as the mariners all know the gales of November remembered You know, um, I feel that sometimes uh, some things in life are uh, enhanced by the people that we've been blessed to share this earth with that can that can tell a good story. So um, I think that being able to articulate a story in a certain way, whether it's through spoken word, through song, uh, reenactment, whatever it is, if you can hold the attention of your audience and tell a story that's good enough that they can almost relive the story in their head, having no idea what the story was even about when it started, that's pretty damn impressive. And that's what that song does for me. Such a well-told story. I love the music. I thought it was great. It was nice and easy. And you know, it just kind of flowed nice, even though it was telling a gruesome tale of 29 people dying. Um... But I think that it told, like, I really got into the story. I was listening. I understood the whole story front to back. It's easy to understand, obviously. First of all, the lyrics are on the screen for you. Second of all, listen to it. It tells a great story. Um, I don't know. I, I like that. That was that was really, it was, that was, it was odd good. And it was just, what I mean is, like, it was so different. You know, it was just different. It was just a well-told story put into a song. And, uh... To honor the people who who died on the uh, the Edmund Fitzgerald, but it was really really good. So I could it's it's like halfway through the song I think was this is this is odd, but I can understand why everybody why everybody likes it. I can understand why it's got 65 million views on YouTube. It's a beautiful song, you know. Uh, there may be a lot more to the story that I don't know about, and there might be all this historical stuff I don't know. I just go and buy the music. I listen to the music, and I tell you what I think of the video and the music. The video, obviously, there wasn't much of a video, which is fine. I'm here to react to the music. The story was awesome. I like that a lot. I want to appreciate all the folks that have uh, have recommended this to me. 
um, I was starting to go through and trying to find everybody, and I'm like, man, this, I mean, I got so many saved comments that I, for this song, it's crazy. So, I didn't want to miss anybody, so I'm just going to say thank you to everybody. But that was really cool. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you'll stick around and come back for some more. Check out the uh, the National Anthem series. That's been going along pretty well. Uh, listen to every National Anthem from every country around the world. Jump on that. Jump on that train. That's something different and fun, right? You guys be good. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And uh, God bless the, uh, the, the souls that we lost on the Edmund Fitzgerald. You guys take care. Scroll up. Thank you.